let's try doing this video again since some people are having issues and my mic quality was really crap <laughs> the last one so first if you found problems with your overwatch game like losing connection to the servers like if you're for example in with me i used to play for like uh, 30 minutes and after that like um, I I get disconnected for a second and come back, but sometimes I come back to the game or you know like you lose all your your old charge and you basically start from the beginning of the game and or maybe just kick me out of the game when not being able to to come to come back and I just get penalty. But yeah. It was just like a disconnection of a sec second, so I I knew like it had something to do with the internet, so I tried first like buying better internet cables. Since this happened, like this was happening to my PC and PlayStation, but um, that didn't work. Since I bought a new one, like a better one, and. And it didn't help much. It was basically the same. So I started doing more stuff. So the thing that worked was first like going into your routing setting settings. So first go in top bar, maybe Google Chrome and type your IP in your router. You should, you should already know this since this is like the first thing you do when you want to uh, install your internet. But if you didn't do this by yourself you can might look it up since it just your like your IP you can't even look like in your phone if it if you type your your internet um and your settings in your phone it, it might say like uh, manage router or something like that but yeah by default your username is admin and password is password I think but after that you can after logging in for the first time you can change it so just sign in and here you can see like your internet's good your name and password the devices are connected and this is really good like to know since you can you can you can like change your settings around and the first thing you want to do is go to dynamic queues and just enable it and after enable it you're gonna get like a test feed of your internet so you can see your downloads and your uploads and keep in mind this is a Netgear Nighthawk so this might be different in yours but, but it can still help if you have one of these or they, or they have like the same option to enable so it is gonna test like your bandwidth so like your internet bandwidth like how much power does it need like speed in each device so after this you can go to attach devices And you can see all your devices, like your tablets, phones, even like the Nintendo Switch that's connected wireless. So after that, act enabling dynamic queues, the internet's gonna know like what specific device needs what specific uh, speed. Since this is this is like my my brother's that um, PC, he already has like high setting, my gaming. Nintendo Switch is highest, so it's gonna need the best internet speed for, you know, like better the uh, performance. My and this is my PC, and I set it to highest, and it's wired. So if you want your best performance from your internet, like for the playing online, you might might as well just connect wire, a wire like a LAN cable. And if uh, this is not highest, you can just click here, and edit and and go from high to highest and and apply so yeah this this is gonna like give more priority 
Moin type Rari. And you can see like all the rice and medium. So th these don't really need that much like phones palette. But yeah, this is gonna really help you if you're having problems because this is like the only thing that worked for me. So yeah, so if anything went wrong or didn't help or work, uh, you can leave it in the comments if it ever did. Uh, leave it in the comments if it has worked. And yeah, hope it worked. Thanks.